Hello and welcome. My name is J. Michael Bennett. I am an orthopedic sports medicine surgeon. Uh, I specialize in uh, injuries of the shoulders, elbows, and knees. Today we're going to be focusing on the elbow. There are a number of ligaments and tendons around the elbow, and these ligaments and tendons can commonly be injured, particularly with any kind of repetitive motion. Now on the other side of the elbow, the lateral side is over here, and the outside of the elbow, and this is the where the common extensors insert, and that allows you to lift your wrist up. And this is where patients will commonly get what's called lateral epicondylitis, also known as tennis elbow. It was originally described by tennis players because of the type of grips that they would use in holding a racket, and it would overload this area. The same exact thing happens with the lateral side as the medial side. The tendon becomes overloaded, these micro tears occur, you get degeneration within that tendon, and this can lead to chronic pain. Once again, you can treat this with bracing, exercise, modification activities, occasionally anti-inflammatories and injection, and if it does not respond, then we tend to obtain an MRI, and very suddenly we need to operate. With fixing the lateral side, we can do the surgery in one of two ways. We can do it arthroscopically with two poke holes on either side of the elbow. We put a camera in there and actually debride this area and repair it, or we can make a small incision about a centimeter and a half or two centimeters big over the site and repair it with an anchor. Many of these issues need to be addressed or at least diagnosed early on to prevent long-term damage. I highly recommend if you have any symptoms such as the ones I've, I've just described that you seek some sort of medical evaluation with a sports medicine trained physician.